So I have to be the second person to do it. Oh boy, boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I have to put myself as... as number two. Understanding the assignment. Big time power bomb. That was one of those power bombs that would shorten someone's career. He catches Cena with a counter. Oh. Mm, nice back rotation suplex. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. He just got sent flying into the opposite ring. Heck is trapped. Suplex. <sighs> nice hip toss. Close line. Oh, that'll leave a mark. Uh oh. Flat jack. Way up there. And the balance of power is about to shift with this upcoming entry. Here we go. <sighs> Kick to the gut. Unleashed from the cage and beelining it to give their team an edge in the match. Well, some might call that showing off, but what a display. What a way to flaunt your abilities. And planted them with a well executed DDT. Something I like about War Games is the emphasis it puts on teamwork. If you don't come in with a cohesive plan and trust your teammates completely, you're going to be in for a world of hurt. You're actually not wrong. That's why War Games often favors more established squads who know one another inside and out. Despicable. That was simply a despicable display we just saw. Placing them right where they want them into the corner. Could be what Cena needed to ignite a rally. Oh, man. No. An uninterrupted surge against Cena here. Yeah, six just can't be stopped now. And entering into an absolute war zone, giving the troops the boost they need. Oh, good night. Sorry. The Rock telling his opponent to get their candy, you know what, over here. Oh. Check out the springboard. Oh my god, a steel chair! Oh my gosh! Here comes the buzzer, the numbers advantage vanishes with this next entrant. And the damage is just going to keep on coming if you can't find the defense for this. And some effective offense for that one. Better make your way into the bedlam quickly, your team needs you. Any one of these attacks could cause irreparable damage, but I don't think you can come back from this many. Boom! Mounted with punches and not entering the ring and these teams. I don't know why he's a, a playable character. I mean 65. And it's the rock with the reversal. 
Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Place target. Caught with the Larian. Oh, man. Pulled in from the belly to belly. The countdown hurtling towards the ship of the status quo. Ooh, dropped right on their face. Stomping. Ouch. He's returning fire. Here they come. We're going to give their team the upper hand as soon as possible. Great way to wear down your opponent. And now having to deal with that weapon is like going up against another table. At once. Oh, kick lands. Not a step ahead of the rock. He's made sure the odds are above and beyond his favor now. Looks like the impending numbers advantage isn't enough for him. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Oh, man. Enters the ring and is diving head first into the chaos of this match. Dead whip, gut wrench, suplex. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. Yeah, right in the fucker. Well, at least someone got used to this.
Excuse me. Oh, finally got it.